Imagine 320 means to us the future of, the, of our children and also the future of our community. Imagine 320 means growing up in a different community, starting a family in a community where God is present and you can feel that He's present. We're excited about what our church family can imagine with Imagine 320, and we are excited about what Cass County and Beyond is going to receive with these gifts. Uh, my name is Travis, and this is my wife, Tasha. And uh, we just want to say how much revolution changed in our lives, and uh, that we know that Imagine 320 is going to change the community, and uh, hopefully, you know, the county and maybe the world around us. God asked us to move here when Anthony was only three years old, and we've been praying for our Logan Sport for many years. And we're just excited and, and believing great things for revolution. Imagine 320 means to us that we have a place for our children to come in the future, for them to feel comfortable, them to worship our Lord in a place that we know is safe, in a place that they don't have to worry and they can fellowship and love the Lord and have Him guide us through everything. Uh, Imagine 320 to us is this, having a place for these little girls. What Imagine 320 means to us is more opportunity just to love on people and do it uh, for the glory of God. Imagine 320 means to us reaching the, the world for Jesus. It's actually a vision with a promise in that uh, the really exciting part for us is the, the church plant that's to come in addition to getting this building and fitting in lots and lots of people. It just means everything to be a part of this initiative, this mission to um, just spread Christ's love to our community and beyond. There's, there's nothing that's more important than that. 1 Corinthians 2.9 is what keeps coming to my mind. It's uh, no eye has seen, no ear has heard, and no mind has imagined the wonderful things that God has prepared for those who love Him. This whole program is, is awesome and it's going to take me to, the, to another level and it's going to take a lot of other people to another level and I can't wait to see how God unravels this. I'm a single mom and I've always thought that I had to work really hard and do everything myself, but then I realized that God's plan is always better than mine and so I'm giving up plan B for His plan A. I was sitting in the front row with my wife and. Uh, tears were just streaming down my face, her face, and just seeing person after person walk to the front, drop that commitment card in one of the ten buckets. This takes a, a whole community of people together for this vision to happen. So God through us is doing this. Thank you so much for being part of this journey called Imagine 320.